Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Crunch by Yo Yo. Welcome back. So today's video is gonna be a little different. It's not an ASMR video, so don't don't comment down below and say where's the where's the cornstarch, cause y'all gonna piss me off. But yeah, and we're gonna do a bunch of video today. And everybody's been asking me to do it. I've been getting requests everywhere how I do my bun so I was like you know what let me just do it for y'all because why not so my hair is freshly blow my hair is freshly blow dried and I washed it exactly for this video so this is how it looks when it's freshly blow dried it's fluffy I already added like my oils and stuff what I use in my hair I'm gonna show y'all what I use so I use like for for growth and moisture and to keep my my scalp and stuff like moisturized I use this this is like the Indian hemp um, hair and scalp treatment it's really good and then I, along with it I use the do girl one this is it it's the do girl one this one is just for triple strength and damaged hair I use that too because sometimes like when I take my hair out in braids I don't know if it's just me but I lose a lot of hair like a lot like I was washing my hair the other day and after I had got the braids that y'all seen I had gotten and I lost so much hair so that's what I use and when I wash my hair I feel like I should just do a whole video on like me taking care of my hair I also use like olive aloe vera like the the actual plant I get it from when they see and I just do like a scalp treatment for my hair and stuff so yeah so this is how it looks when it's freshly blow dried you see yeah okay so it's very fluffy and very like smooth and stuff and well moisturized so we're gonna jump right into the video so I like to start off by um, combing out my hair just so I can make sure everything, just so I can make sure my bun is very full. So I, so I comb it out in the back, in the front of my hair. And I'm not a tender headed person unless somebody else is touching my hair. But if I'm touching my hair, I could do anything I want to it. But as soon as somebody else touch my hair, that's when I'm tender headed. But today we're going to be using this gel that I bought today. I just wanted to try something different. This is the lock and um, twist wave gel. It's an extra hold. And y'all, it was freaking $27. So I'm like, this should better be good. This should better hold down my hair too. Because $27, it doesn't really have a smell to it. But we're about to try it and see what it's giving. So I like to start off by adding gel to the front of my hair. But yeah, like I honestly never used to like my natural hair. Like as much as y'all see, I love my natural hair. Right now, it never used to be like that. It really took me a long time to actually like love my natural hair because when i was in um, middle school i used to get bullied for my natural black hair so people used to like i remember this teacher was laughing at my hair one time i came out and did like a fresh twist out and she was like i did a twist out and then she was like oh why your hair look like that it looked nappy like she was just being mad disrespectful and then I also had friends who were like different, you know, different race. And they also did the same thing. Like, so it took me a long time to actually love my hair and stuff because of my I looked there. So until I got to high school and I ended up moving I went to an all-white school that's where like the bullying had with my hair started when I was rocking my hair my natural hair 
<clears throat> they just used to be so disrespectful over there. And this was Boston. And then I moved to Miami and it was very different because I was not in like an all white school like Boston. And in Miami it was different. There was a bunch of people in my color and you know, a lot of Haitian people. So I didn't experience that there. But yeah. And I will always say like always rock your natural hair. You have beautiful we have be we as black people have beautiful hair and don't ever let no other race tear you down because honestly they will tear you down because they don't like themselves that's what i say because when i went to those white schools it's just been a bunch of white girls just doing the most for no reason like they would act like a certain type of way towards me i don't know because they felt like i was prettier than them but it is what it is like that's not my business like literally but um, I add the gel. I'm gonna add some in the back of my head too, and I'm gonna use my hard brush. Y'all, don't make fun of my brush. This brush been through it all. Like, don't even. I don't even want y'all looking at that brush. But I have got it from Family Dollar, and it's like one of those hard brushes, so it comes in handy when I use them. Like, it works very well for me. So I like to brush the front of my hair in the back as well and this so far y'all this gel is actually really good i like it i haven't seen no shine yet because most gels i use they get like very oily and stuff but this one is pretty good so if you ever and i'm gonna use some of this if you ever um go to your beauty supply store you should definitely get you some lock and gel lock-in um, twist braid wave gel. So I'm gonna use a little bit of my, this don't even look like a little bit. <laughs> I'm gonna use a lot of this. And this is the got to be goo yellow one. You really just need a little bit. And I use it for extra hold cause I really like when my hair is like really slicked down and stuff. So that's why I also use that. And then I'm just gonna brush it out. But yeah, y'all, you know, like, I honestly love my natural hair so much. Like, over the years, overcome me not liking it to me just wearing it. And I got, I get so many compliments on my hair daily of people saying, oh my gosh, I love it. Because it's just so different. Because nowadays, you see, like, a lot of, like, black women, they don't wear their natural hair. Well, that's what I be seeing. And there's nothing wrong with not wearing it. There's nothing wrong with like wearing weave and stuff, but sometimes you just gotta let your natural hair breathe and wear it. <laughs> so my natural, I feel like my hair just compliments me. Like it just makes me who I am. Like, you know, it just makes me stand out from the rest. And I love braids too. Like I love braids. I love using some braids. I just don't like wigs and shit. Wigs are not for me. <clears throat> Cause every every wig I done had look like a damn helmet, and I can't. But braids, I love braids. They're really good for protective styles and shit. <clears throat> so I'm gonna use my big ass scrunchies. These are jumbo scrunchies. I'm gonna to show y'all. Y'all need to run to your beauty supply store. If you have big ass hair, these scrunchies will save your life. So these are the scrunchies that I use. These were like 99 cents, 99 cents at the beauty supply store. They're the jumbo scrunchies and they have like the white ones and the black ones. So run to your beauty supply store and get those scrunchies, girl. They good. All right, so I'm gonna scoop the hair up with my hand. And I'm gonna tie it really tightly. Yeah, these crunchies, y'all. 
because I used to buy like the little tiny scrunchies, which didn't help me at all because they always used to break. But these scrunchies right here save my hair. So I'm gonna go like this and just tighten it some more. The back, everything looked good in the back. Everything looks good. I'm gonna add some more gel in the front of my hair just so it could be more, um, you know, more hold. Cause I wanted to have extra hold. But so far, I love this gel, and I hope I don't run through it. So after I'm done doing that, I'm gonna use some of my Eco Styling Gel only for the back of my hair. Just only a little bit. So next is my favorite part, and this is how the bun looks so far. Let me back up, I feel like I'm way too close to the camera. So this is how it looks so far, and I love it. So we're gonna use my, um, y'all this, don't even look at this either. I be abusing myself, but we're gonna use my um, edge brush to do the edges and edges is my favorite part like honestly i want to start like learning how to do like the dramatic edges where you do like the little the little um twirls to it they be looking real nice so i'm gonna start doing that but today we're just gonna keep the edges like i always keep it my signature edges so i like to like get some I don't like to take out too many edges. And, ooh. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna like um, brush out right here a little bit more. All right. So I'm gonna use the lock in gel to do my um, baby hairs and stuff. Yeah, I love this gel so far, so good. So I'm gonna add a little bit of a gel to each baby hair. And then I'm gonna go like this. This is how I do my edges personally. If you don't know how to do your edges, I could do an edge tutorial. Like this, this is how I do it. You place your hand on there and you just Use the comb to like swoop it up. You know, do the same thing. And I never used to be this good at edges. Practice does make perfect. So practicing does help if you wanna learn how to do your edges. And you're not gonna get it in one day, but, and even if you get it in one day, that's amazing, but you really just gotta like practice to know how to do edges cause they are not gonna always come out right. And I'm really not good at doing edges on other people. Like I could do my own edges, but when it comes to doing other people's edges, y'all, I be struggling. I remember one time my friend got mad cause I couldn't do her edges. I'm like, girl, I cannot do it. I'm not even doing that on purpose. Like I could not do her edges for nothing. So this is how my hair looks. And yeah, this is how it looks. I see it. And let me have some chapstick, some lip gloss to my lips. Everything looking real nice. like to see from me comment subscribe and give me a thumbs up and turn on your post notification bells 
so you guys can know whenever I post. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And remember, deuces. Let me stop. All right, bye guys. Let me stop. I do too much. But yeah. And remember, always love your natural hair.